Yo, what's up, YouTube? I'm back again with another video, and I hope y'all having a happy Fourth of July. Me personally, I'm just keep doing my regular routine stuff. I'm tired of that Fourth of July crap. Shit, I'd be glad to see it go. Folks standing all around getting drunk, playing music and shit. Anyway, guys, let's get on this video. Right here, guys, I'm playing. Um, I'm about to paint, plan on painting this um, undercarriage on my truck here. And uh, y'all seen me do it before. Let's come back with another video. As you can see, some of the stuff right here starting to rust. Just want to kind of get in there a little bit, do a little paint on it for you guys. And people don't pay attention to stuff like this a lot. Which this is the main, most important part of the vehicle, in my opinion. For the paint and stuff. You know, they'll paint the outside of a vehicle and stuff like that, man. You know, they worry about the looks of the vehicle. And the bottom of it be rusting out. Like your leaf springs and stuff like this. You need to keep that stuff halfway painted up if you can. You know what I'm saying, guys? And, uh, try to keep some kind of paint on it anyway. The best way to do it, guys, is take the tire off. And I'll do it, but I'm just, you know, hitting a little bit here. You know, and like I said, people worry about the outside of the vehicle, the paint and all that crap. They forget all about what's going on under the bottom. You got parts and stuff that's resting out and shit like that. What you need to get up on the bottom of the vehicle, too. That's important because you just think. All your stuff up under there, a lot much better that looks, guys. Your leaf springs and all that kind of crap be rusting out. And uh, that's what you you really don't want that, you know. You want kind of keep the stuff painted up like this here. Don't oh, forget all about stuff like this. And it really needs paint. You need to pay special attention to stuff like this. This stuff, these parts are rust out on you, man, and break. Especially the leaf spring. Yeah, it rust out, get thin, and break. Check that out. Even though it makes the whole truck look better, also, just by doing this. And people don't know it, it changed the whole appearance of the vehicle. With the paint and all, you know. I also say your truck will rust now under the bottom where you can't see it is. That's where it's most important in my opinion. The parts you can't see usually be the ones that fail. The rust is out on you, see. But people don't really consider that. Yo. Yep, guys, check that out. How much better that looks. And you can see, I mean, you can just go up under the bottom, start painting up on the rear end and stuff like that. Anything you think might be rust. Try to get some paint on it. You know, and we don't know even, okay, this is an older vehicle here. But just think, man. You know, it doesn't take long for stuff to start to rust out and stuff like that. So you're looking at, you know, even like a 2010 model vehicle uh, start to rust up under the bottom. You know, it depends on where your location, where you stay in. Some people stay in more places where more water and salt water and stuff like that. And uh, you have to consider stuff like this, man. You know, you, you all like Virginia Beach, for example, Florida places like that where people stay where it's more humid it's more water environments you know beaches and stuff like that around y'all more prone to salt water and stuff like that so you want to kind of keep your undercarriage and stuff like that painted up you know it's important i think man you know a lot of people look at the outside of the vehicle but if we're getting about getting all about what's going on underneath the vehicle that's where the problem occurred. Then you can start had to pay thousands, thousands of dollars how stuff welded back together and patched back up and all that shit. When you could have took care of it from the get go, 
you know. So guys, yeah, I just want to come back with a little short video. Paint up on the undercarriage. This is what I'm doing for the 4th of July. I ain't studying all that party shit. And these folks need to quit their crap out, getting drunk, standing all around every damn way and shit, looking crazy. But anyway, guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. I want to thank all my viewers and my subscribers for watching my videos. And I'll get tired of all that damn loud ass motherfucking music. Niggas getting drunk and shit. Standing all over every damn well. Pants about to fall off the ass. It just don't make no damn sense. I'd be glad to see the 5th of July come. Anyway guys, take care and I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace out YouTube.